And we are following more breaking news. One person is dead and a toddler is in the hospital after a house fire in Jamestown. Thanks for joining us. I'm Mary Alice Demler. And hello everyone. I'm Scott Levin. Two firefighters were also injured during the rescue. Two on your sides, Leanne Stuck joins us with the developments from Jamestown. Yeah, the Jamestown Fire Department is still working to figure out what exactly caused a house fire here on Kidder Street that killed one person and sent a three-year-old to the hospital. About 1.45 p.m., Jamestown Fire crews were called to 109 Kidder Street for a reported house fire with uh, victims trapped inside the residence. Uh, when our members first made entry, they were uh, greeted by a heavy fire load on the first floor, um, extending up onto the second floor. Firefighters initially rescued a 19-year-old man and a 3-year-old from the blaze. They were both taken to UPMC Chautauqua for treatment. But around 6 o'clock, officials announced the 19-year-old died at the hospital. The 3-year-old was then transferred to Oshai Children's Hospital. My last update that I received was the 3-year-old child is doing okay, uh, in stable condition. A witness to the fire said she could hear the baby crying from inside the house. The worst thing was hearing the baby cry and us not being able to get to the baby. And and then, then the baby, it was silent. So like, you didn't hear him no more. So, of course, you're going to think the worst. And uh, But the fire department, they did a great job. They they they, they got him out and, and the baby's okay. Two firefighters also sustained burn injuries from the rescue. The cause of the fire is still under investigation. In Jamestown, Leanne Stock, Channel 2 News.